Hello Pisces, my beautiful fucking Pisces. I seen that in one of the comments. I swear to God, y'all, I'm trying to get the fucking signs out, but Spirit has like a whole nother fucking thing, so I'm trying to do what I can. So hopefully by the end of the week. Because I've been trying to upload the videos and my fucking little jank-ass bone gets hot, okay? So it's like, what the fuck? Everything is like falling apart. But I know when shit falls apart, it's stuff falling into place. So y'all bear with me, okay, Pisces? So, Pisces. What you all got going on? What you all got going on? I'm being drawn to put my cigarette out, okay? This must be important if Daddy's putting his cigarette out, okay? Lord have mercy. They're saying take a drink, too. Shit. Pisces, what the hell? What the fuck we gonna get into, Pisces? Ugh. Uh, well, I had a little burp coming up, guys. I prefer it was a bigger one. Uh, so for that, that tells me, uh, Pisces, you're holding back. Someone has it. Someone's holding back. Someone's wanting to gurgle up, okay? Someone's wanting to gurgle up. Someone's wanting to come. Uh, something's wanting to come to the surface. How about that, Pisces? Ooh, God protects me and God fights my battles. No weapon formed in spirit or against me shall prosper. I'm highly favored and protected from all evil, as is my beautiful Pisces Collective. Pisces, what is going on with you? Mm. Oh my god, I'm sitting there, I got reminded of some kid from high school who was a Pisces. He's a little cutie, too. He turned out to be, he was pretty and smart. He turned out to be a pretty good kid. Well, he's my age now, maybe a year or two younger. Ooh. Wow. Okay, that's weird. I hadn't thought of him in a while. Oh, Pisces, maybe that's it. Pisces, you might have someone from your past wanting to come back. And when I say past, I mean like your past, okay? It could be someone that you went to school with or college, something in that kind of setting that you kind of lost track of. Most definitely. For that to come up, that, that's definitely a reference. So this is like a good person from the past, okay? So this wanting to come up, maybe if, uh, you know, everyone befriending all these high school friends from uh, on Facebook and shit, maybe, maybe someone you befriended is actually looking at you. For me to get that reference, is this kid was pretty nice. I say kid because we were kids together. So this person could be, uh, what, daddy's 46, about... Between 41 and 44, that could factor in for somebody. <laughs> That's Jackie saying, yeah, you old fuckers. Ugh. Jackie's old. She's 11, guys. So, you know, she's like, fuck you, daddy. <laughs> I haven't given her a little. I give her some uh, children's, uh, uh, like Tylenol ibuprofen every other day. Just to kind of help her with her arthritis. We all know when arthritis kicks in, right? Pisces, why am I drawn to... Oh, Pisces, no! What? Oh. Now, y'all, see, I didn't even do my normal spread. This is what wanted to pop out. So, y'all, I got something going on, okay? Something going on. Okay, y'all, I said going on. I'm channeling Spiritual Sag. So, go check out her channel, okay? She got a message for you. What's going on? What's uh, what's going on? What's going on? Mm, ten of swords. This is brutal. Okay, this is brutal. Okay, good spirit. Clarify yourself. That's a ten, guys. It's an ending. Time for something new. Time for something new, Pisces. Okay, spirit. You pulled that shit out. What you got on it? Oh, queen of cups. Okay. Four swords. Ace of Cups in reverse, and the Three of Pentacles in reverse, and the Five of Cups. Oh, this was a separation, wasn't it? This Queen of Cups, she's healing a broken heart. Oh, oh, maybe you all made an offer. You're, this Queen of Cups definitely had had um, her cups emptied, okay? She's going through some healing. And how appropriate, Pisces. The water sign. Oh, sweetie. Sweetie, for some of you, this could definitely be in a, a, a marriage, a, a, 
Uh, definitely a fucking marriage, right? The three of pentacles here going to the five of pentacles. Maybe someone left you out in the cold. You know, you tried and tried and tried to make shit work. Because you are the queen of cups here. So I know you gave it your all. You were kind, loving, and generous. And, you know, maybe somebody just fucking spilt your cup. They were very reckless how they treated you. They were very fucking reckless. Because look at how she looks at that cup so lovingly. You gave it so, so willingly and so, it was so fucking pure. Oh my God. Oh my God, Pisces. Oh my God. That's awful. I hope this wasn't that person from your past. Maybe you guys were high school sweethearts. College sweethearts. Oh, Pisces. What the fuck? Ooh, Pisces. Hmm. Damn, that was brutal, guys. Right off the bat. What the fuck? Spirit. What's going on here? What's going on? Pisces, you all have got some shit, okay? Ten of Wands. Ten of Swords, the Ten of Wands. You're still carrying this burden. What the fuck is this card gonna be? Yeah. You, you need to start over. New everything, okay? New every fucking thing. It is done. Bury the fucking dead. Go buy you a pretty outfit to put this person in the fucking ground. You know what I mean? Metaphorically speaking. Some of y'all, maybe you need to go out in your backyard, get you one of them old school matchbox, or go buy you a pretty box of Dollar Tree and put some mementos in there and just give this person, like, a, the proper burial. Because this shit has got to stop. If you haven't done it yet, you need to. Okay, watch the video I just uh, put up. Uh, don't be a pussy. Uh, or don't watch this if you're a pussy, okay? This is about getting that spark of inspiration, okay? Shit has got to end. Whatever you're doing now, flip that fucking script. I know, I know, sweetie. I know you were the queen of cups and they were very reckless with your cup. I understand that. But spirit's like, okay, okay. You know, you're allowed a week to fall apart. Then you got to get your ass up and fucking start moving forward. Yeah. Because this is where spirit wants you. Out of this fucking heartbreak. As fast as you can because at the end of the day you're still the fucking queen of cups you can't change your your love right it was the lover not the love that broke your heart okay uh your love wasn't wrong uh, who you choose to chose to give your love to was a wrong choice and how they choose to treat you that's going to be on them because my guess is they're probably never going to find anybody that's going to love and care for them the way you did and as reckless as they treated your cup, you just know that down the road, someone's going to fucking treat their cup the same damn way. Ooh, child, I'm feeling this shit. You got to let it go. Okay, I know, I know you're healing, and I know that's easier said than done, but whatever the fuck you need to do. Because at the end of the day, spirit wants you away from this energy. You got bigger plans. They want you to take that leap of faith. Move away from this toxic energy. The toxic energy that fucked with your cup. So this tells me that they're probably wanting to still come around, right? This is the motherfucker that after they break your heart, want to text you and say, how are you doing? They never can leave you the fuck alone, right? They know what the fuck they did. They just want to keep coming back to remind you, okay? This person is a fucking piece of shit, okay? Get rid of the number. Change your fucking number. Do whatever you need to do to prevent this person from having access to you. Because, honey, what spirit wants you to do, you're going to take that fucking love of yours. You're going to heal your broken heart, and you are going to fucking shine. You're going to get the healing that you need. And in the process of healing, you're going to find the inner strength. Nine of Swords. Okay, that energy is definitely prevalent. There's a reason that video I did today, and then Pisces, because I seen it, it showed up in my subscription. Someone's a Sagittarius with Pisces. Someone was wanting a Pisces reading, okay? You know who you are. Uh, 
I hope the hell this is your energy and not just a, 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 a reflection of that last reading. But you know what? If this is what's in the air, guys, it's what's in the fucking air. I go by the energy. But you've seen the cards that wanted to flip out. I was drawn to pull out of the ordinary from what I normally do. So this is like... I spirit wants you to just take that fucking leap of faith into happiness, but you got, you, you know, it's not you, honey. It's not you. Someone abused your cup and treated it like shit. That is not your fault. What you have control over is the healing process and what you're going to do to change it. Because honey, you're still going to be the queen of cups. Okay. They might have spilt that cup, but you picked it up, you polished it, you cleaned it, you refilled it back with love. Okay, that's how you're going to move forward. Spirit don't want you to give up on the love, just because it was treated so fucking recklessly. Ooh. Ooh, Pisces, what the fuck? Ace of Wands again, I'm telling you. Spirit saying, get over it, okay? Why am I drawn to say if you're still fucking this person? If you know this situation is dead, they are still in contact with you, aren't they? You are still you are still allowing them in you, even though you know how this person fucking treated you. Pisces? Pisces. Now daddy's going to fuck a bitch here. What have I been saying? Why what, get over this being dickmatized, honey? There's better dick out there. If they're just going to come in and break your fucking heart and throw it away, uh, no. I don't care how good the fucking dick is, okay? For my men, I don't care how good the pussy is. It is not worth that. It is not worth your fucking heart, your love, your soul, okay? Just for a fucking piece of ass. Just to get fucked, okay? Because that's just fucking. That ain't love. You need to just ditch this fucking person. Oh, Manipulative energy. Yes, this person, this person is working against you getting this new start. This person knows you're going to fucking glow up. You're going to be someone special. That's why they got to come around. This, If this is all a person has to offer you, and this is all you're willing to accept from somebody, you need to sit down and really think about what your fucking priorities are. Okay? Okay? Now, when a gay man tells you to think about your priorities around dick, your bitch ass better fucking listen, okay? But there's plenty of these out there that are attached to people who aren't going to fuck you up and take advantage of your love, okay? If they take advantage of your love, uh-uh, no, sweetie, no, sweetie. They need to stick with people that are just interested in them one night stands and go the fuck away. Because all this person wants to do is fuck with your new start. They don't want to see you move on because they know, they know that you can do better. You can find better. They just want to keep you off the fucking market. The Hermit in reverse, Page of Wands in reverse, and the Seven of Wands. This person just wants to keep you stuck. They want to keep your ass stuck. Seven, seven Wands here plus the Eight the one there is Eight of Wands. Eight of Wands with the Eight of Pentacles. This person just wants to keep you fucking stuck. Because they know your ass can do better. So if you haven't seen them in a while or you haven't heard from them because they probably ghosted your ass like they always do. Leave you all heartbroken and sad because they ain't talking to you. And then they will come out of the fucking blue. I don't like this energy, Pisces. Leave them the fuck alone. Okay? And when a gay man tells you to move on from the dick, there's more dick out there. Okay? Ooh, Pisces, what the fuck? Now y'all now y'all just pissed me off. Because it's like, honey, no. 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 Ooh, Pisces, what the hell? Y'all making me feisty and bitchy. Mm-mm-mm. Mm-mm-mm. Come on, Spear, what you got? See, I'm drawn to do this. Let's just see what the fuck wants to pop out, Pisces, because apparently you all ain't listening to daddy for shit, okay? So, okay. Spear, what you got? Yeah, the Ten of uh, Pentacles here, the family. Okay, if this is someone you were in a relationship with and y'all are trying to break up, but you keep getting back together, you just won't let it fucking end. 
You just won't let it fucking end. Two tens here. What we've had the ten of swords, the ten of pentacles, and the ten of fucking wands. Okay? What more do you fucking need? What more do you fucking need? This person is just holding you back from going out there and doing what the fuck you, you should be doing. You could be doing. Because they know you can do better than them. Okay? Any given point in the fucking day, you could do better than them. Now, men, this could be a woman doing this shit to you. Take it how it resonates, right? Whoever the fuck this person is you're dealing with knows that you can do better than them any fucking given day of the week. This person this person is just a manip manipulative piece of fucking shit. But they're only that way because you continue to fucking allow it. You're probably cheating on each other. Maybe you tried the open relation. This person's going to let you do whatever and whoever to keep your ass around, right? This is the energy. Because as long as you don't leave, Pisces, is this you letting someone do this to you? To keep someone around, you just said, okay, do whatever you want as long as, as long as we're still together. You're together, but you're not together. You're roommates. Mm, Pisces, y'all... I don't care what fucking card I pull. Until you choose to pull your head out of your ass, and move the fuck on. This is your choice. This is your choice. You willingly choose to stay here. I don't, I don't even want to hear it, Pisces. You choose to stay here. You choose to fucking stay here. Ooh, sweet Jesus. Pisces, I do not mean to be a bitch. Well, you know what? I do mean to be a bitch. Because I, I can feel the energy. Spirit is like agitated. They're like, what? You check in tarot readings for what? They don't fucking love you. They don't fucking want you. They just want to keep you stuck. Whoever you're dealing with, whatever side of this coin you're on, you're either trying to keep someone against their will or someone is trying to keep you against your will. And you're doing every fucking desperate little attempt you can instead of just fucking moving on. Ten of Pentacles again. It's a war at home, isn't it? That ain't, that ain't a pretty fucking situation. It's a battlefield. It's a battleground. Lots of landmines around. Pisces, is this your energy I'm picking up? Feeling like I'm tiptoeing around a rattlesnake's den? That's what it feels like. You're tiptoeing around the little landmines. Anything you can to keep what the fuck... Little resemblance of this horrific family in place. At the end of the day, you're still fucking alone. Okay, men, you could be fucking massaging your own fucking wand at the end of the day. Women, you're taking care of business yourself because you see this person is alone and sad. Even though, even though they're in a fucking relationship. Sweet Jesus, sweet Jesus, Pisces. You know, shit or get off the pot. If this is the life you want, go into a reader. We can't change that. And daddy just did. Now, I don't know which side of this coin you're on, Pisces, but when daddy gets this energy, I can tell your ass this much. Spirit is around you. Your ancestors are around you. There are people, you are getting the signs that you need to move the fuck on, but you're staying put for whatever fucking reason. And spirit's gonna let your bitch ass until it gets to the point when spirit steps in with a fucking tower moment. Pisces, you're not going to like the fucking results. Or whoever you're dealing with is not going to like the fucking results. They're tiptoeing around a fucking landmine in a situation that should be loving and kind. How long until you step on that motherfucking landmine? What's going to happen then? That's when you truly get hurt. For some of you, this could actually lead to physical altercation. This could actually lead to some harm. This is when spirit, when spirit's going to step down on this. 
because you're blocking yourself from moving forward or someone is blocking you from moving forward into growth and abundance and happiness. That's what's agitating the spirits right now. Someone knows and sees happiness. They see the blue sky. They see the ocean waves. They see love and happiness and kindness and all this beautiful fucking energy. Pisces, you're the freaking queen of cups. Why are you giving that fucking energy away to someone that just discards it? Mm. Spirit, what is a resolution for Pisces? And we're going to use another deck here, Pisces. What's what's the resolution for Pisces here, Spirit? What's the message? Emperor in reverse on the five of conflict. Yeah, you're dealing with someone who you just try to do whatever you can to avoid any arguments. Uh, if this is a masculine, an emperor energy, a man, you know, you don't feel like you have any power. You just tiptoeing around like a little bitch, hoping to not get any arguments going. For women, this is a man in your life who isn't a fucking emperor, who can't make up his mind what the fuck he wants, and you're just appeasing him to keep any conflicts down. Oh yeah, that sounds like fucking love to me. Sign me up for that shit, please. Oh hey, I'm just gonna stay in it because, you know, for whatever fucking reason... I want a piece of shit in my life. Ooh, spirit, what the fuck? What the fuck? Well, I can tell you this now. Uh, there's going to be a tower moment, okay? There's going to be a tower moment. Something that spirit is going to step in on this situation, and there's going to be a tower moment of all mother fucking tower moment. If your bitch ass wasn't going to move before, Spirit's going to have this tower come and he, he, they're just going to throw your bitch ass out the fucking window. They're going to be like, okay, now we gave you every opportunity to walk out the fucking front door. Now you didn't want to do it. So Spirit's going to be like, we just going to throw your bitch ass out a fucking window and you're going to see this ain't where you fucking belong. Y'all, I don't even think I know any motherfucking Pisces. What the fuck is going on? I don't know any fucking Pisces. Oh, good Lord. Yeah, this King of Cups isn't your match, sweetie. Or dude, whatever the hell, right? Uh, uh yeah. This person will never be your equal. This Queen of Cups is waiting for this King of Cups. He'll never be your fucking equal. And yeah, they fucking people on the side. So you know this. You just turn a blind eye to it. Male or female, guys. Male or female on this shit. Right? If it's a masculine, maybe the woman wears the fucking pants and you're the bitch in the fucking situation. Whatever the hell. Someone is doing their thing while the other person is just being obedient, okay? Knight of Cups, Queen of Wands in reverse, and the Knight of Pentacles. Yeah, you know what? Someone knows where they want to go. Someone wants to come in with this offer of love, but they ain't doing a damn fucking thing. And definitely the Knight of Pentacles here with the Queen of Wands in reverse. Someone sees where they want to go, who they want to be with. But they're still stuck trying to keep a situation going that is shit. They want something new. Now, Pisces, you either going to do it or not. I don't even have to read the fucking cards. I can tell you from this energy and this agitation, it is building up. Because you are getting the signs that you need to get the fuck out of here. Spirit is telling you. Your ancestors are telling you. Everyone is telling you to get the fuck out. Out And the longer you stave off doing this, making this fucking decision, when spirit steps in, instead of your ass going out the fucking door, you're going to go out a fucking window. Because spirit's going to come in and there's going to be pick your ass up off the fucking couch while you sitting there crying and boo-hooing because you ain't happy with somebody and just throw your bitch ass out the fucking window and be like, we're done, okay? You don't want to make the decision, we're going to do it for you. Here you go. You ain't got fucking options. Move the fuck on. Focus on the good that's ahead. Because this person sees, you see the good. You see the happiness. I mean, that's the energy, guys. It's like this person sees all this fucking beautiful, peaceful, love, kindness. They see it. It's right there. And then the big bad wolf walks in the fucking door, right? Or this scary monster comes into the fucking room. And this person can see it. 
They see the happiness, but they're still dealing with this fucking, uh, this, this monster, this demon, this big bad wolf energy, right? Woo, Pisces. I didn't think I'd have to ring my motherfucking bell today. Woo! Okay. Woo, get centered, spirit. Get centered. You can ring my bell. Ring my bell. Lord, Pisces. 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 I hate when you all make daddy be a dick. I'm, I'm, seriously, Pisces, if this is your story, if this is your story, get prepared for that tower moment because I'm telling you it's coming. And when it comes... What you were unwilling to do before, honey, you ain't going to have a choice. I mean, you are not going to have a fucking choice. Mm -mm. There's some sage, sweetie. Dude, whoever the hell needs this, because I am telling you, when spirit decides to step in on this, because spirit's getting a little pissed off, someone ain't going where they need to be going. Okay, I'm just going to tell you that. That tower moment isn't going to be sweet, but you know what? It's going to get the job done. And it's going to get your you, get you moving in the direction you need to go, Pisces. So, it was a shitty reading. And the fact that the energy is shit. But the beautiful thing about it, the beautiful thing about it, is when that tower moment comes, it's going to take away any and all those restrictions that were preventing any movement. You realize that, right? You can either choose to do this willingly on your own damn terms. Because when spirit comes in, spirit ain't going to be fucking happy. So the good news is, this is going to get a resolution. Now, on your behalf, that's going to depend upon whether or not you willingly decide to do it or your spirit comes in and steps in on your behalf. Are you all hearing that noise that just come on towards the end? That's like, kind of like a siren. Is it a siren? What the fuck is that? Yeah, that's just clarification. Oh, my ears. Oh. Yeah. It's a beautiful reading, Pisces, and the fact that if you don't take action, uh, it's going to get done on your behalf. So you can either be a willing participant or you know, you're going to go against your will. Either way. Yeah, it is a siren. That's Archangel Michael. Yeah, are you praying to Archangel Michael? Pray to Archangel Michael. He's watching. And for Archangel Michael to show up in this, when I tell you, instead of going out the fucking front door, your ass is going to be going out a fucking window. You're going to be going out a fucking window. Now, guys, that's metaphorically speaking, right? You're not going to be going out the way you came in. Okay? They're talking in the spirit realms. Your guides, your ancestors, your loved ones up above are chattering. You hear this? They do not like this situation. That's why the big guy's going to step in. Archangel Michael, I tell you what, I love that dude. But he will bitch slap you, sucker punch you, and do every fucking thing he can. You're going to learn the fucking lesson. Going to be like, you do this willingly or, you know, whatever the hell. If I have to get involved, I ain't nice. And I don't knock. Ooh, Pisces. Peace, love, and light. But it's beautiful energy. Y'all let me know how this skins. If it, well, I know how this is going to end. Just let me know when you survived it. <laughs> I love you guys, Pisces, but... <sighs> I know it's tough. Do the right thing, though. You're being guided, too. I don't have to tell you that. Peace, love, and light.